Do you remember the first time you delved into the enigmatic world of the Twilight Zone? Perhaps you've heard whispers of lesser known facts and anecdotes about this iconic TV series that have left you intrigued. Created by Rod Serling, The Twilight Zone first aired in 1959 and it continues to captivate audiences with its thought-provoking narratives and unexpected twists. As we journey into this realm of the mysterious and the surreal, we invite you to share your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this timeless series. We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Now, let's uncover some intriguing facts about the Twilight Zone that may surprise you. The Twilight Zone, a groundbreaking television series created by Rod Serling, made its debut in 1959 and left an indelible mark on the world of science fiction and horror. Known for its iconic opening narration and eerie theme music, the show presented standalone episodes, each delving into thought-provoking, often allegorical tales that explored the depths of human nature and the supernatural. Serling himself served as the charismatic host and narrator, introducing viewers to a dimension of imagination where ordinary people found themselves in extraordinary, often unsettling situations. The series featured a wide array of memorable characters and scenarios, from aliens and time travelers to everyday individuals facing moral dilemmas and twisted realities. The Twilight Zone became a cultural touchstone, influencing countless filmmakers, writers, and artists, and its enduring impact can still be felt in contemporary storytelling and popular culture. It continues to be celebrated for its masterful storytelling, unexpected twists, and enduring exploration of the human condition, making it a timeless classic in the annals of television history. Rod Serling wrote 92 episodes himself of the total 156 episodes in the original series. This made him the driving force behind the Twilight Zone. His unique storytelling and thought-provoking narratives are a key reason for the show's enduring popularity. Serling's work on the series solidified his reputation as one of the most influential figures in science fiction television. In fact, he was ranked number one in TV Guide's list of the 25 greatest sci-fi legends. Serling's contributions to the Twilight Zone continue to captivate audiences and are a testament to his storytelling prowess. The Twilight Zone, the iconic 1959 TV series, is known for its memorable narration by Rod Serling. While many associate the phrase submitted for your approval with the show, it's interesting to note that this phrase is only heard in three episodes, Cavender is coming, in praise of Pip, and a kind of a stopwatch. This distinctive narration added a touch of mystery and intrigue to the series. The first season of The Twilight Zone featured a curious pattern. Almost all the male characters introduced by Rod Serling's opening narration were described as being 36 years old. This consistent detail in the introductions gave the show a unique and somewhat eerie quality, further emphasizing the uncanny nature of the stories within. An interesting connection exists between the Twilight Zone and the music world. Michael Jackson sampled Rod Serling's narrations in his song Threatened. The two most noticeable episodes he sampled from were It's a Good Life and in his image. This shows the enduring influence of the Twilight Zone, even in the realm of music. These facts shed light on some intriguing aspects of the Twilight Zone, from its iconic narration to a curious age pattern in season one, and even its influence on popular music. The show remains a timeless classic that continues to captivate audiences with its tales of the bizarre, supernatural, and unknown. The Twilight Zone, the iconic TV series from 1959, has a fascinating history. One intriguing fact is that Rod Serling, the show's creator and host, wanted Richard Egan to do the narration due to his rich, deep voice. However, due to strict studio contracts of the time, Egan couldn't participate. Serling was adamant, stating, it's Richard Egan or no one. It's Richard Egan or I'll do the thing myself. As a result, Rod Serling ended up providing the narration himself. This determination and commitment to his vision are part of what made The Twilight Zone a classic. The series, known for its thought-provoking and often eerie stories, continues to captivate audiences to this day. So, next time you watch an episode of The Twilight Zone, remember that it might have sounded quite different if not for Rod Serling's insistence on having Richard Egan's voice. It's just one of the many intriguing aspects of this timeless show.
The Twilight Zone, a 1959 TV series, holds a notable place in television history. Created by Rod Serling, this anthology show presented viewers with a variety of thought-provoking and mysterious stories. The show's unique blend of science fiction, fantasy, and the supernatural captivated both critics and the general public. One interesting fact about the series is that during its second season, budget constraints led to a cost-cutting measure. Some episodes were shot on videotape instead of film. Videotape was a relatively primitive medium at the time, making editing challenging. To work with this medium, the episodes were camera cut in a live television style set up on a studio soundstage, limiting location shooting. Eventually, due to the limitations of using videotape, the network switched back to film, despite the increased cost. This experiment, while short-lived, saved the producers around $5,000 per episode. The Twilight Zone's impact was so profound that it became a landmark series in the history of television. Rod Serling's subsequent projects, including Night Gallery, couldn't replicate the same level of success and influence that The Twilight Zone achieved. In 2018, CBS compiled a list of the 10 most terrifying episodes from the original series, reflecting its enduring popularity. Some of these episodes, like Nightmare at 20,000 Feet and Time Enough at Last, remain iconic to this day. In summary, The Twilight Zone from 1959 left an indelible mark on television, combining imaginative storytelling with budgetary challenges that led to unique experiments in production. This series continues to be celebrated for its timeless and thought-provoking content. The Twilight Zone, the iconic TV series from 1959, is known for its thought-provoking and mysterious stories. One interesting fact about the show is that its creator, Rod Serling, thought he had coined the term The Twilight Zone. However, after the show aired, he discovered that it was already in use by U.S. Air Force pilots to describe the transitional space between day and night above the Earth. This revelation adds a unique layer of intrigue to the series. The Twilight Zone has often been associated with the concept of the unknown and the unexplained, making this connection to the Air Force term quite fitting. The show's focus on strange and mysterious events aligns with the idea of entering a realm where the ordinary rules no longer apply. Despite the flood of over 14,000 script submissions from viewers, Serling only found two that met the show's standards. Unfortunately, they didn't fit the show's format, highlighting the challenge of crafting stories that fit the unique atmosphere of the Twilight Zone. As a testament to its enduring impact, the series was ranked number 8 in TV Guide's list of the 25 top cult shows ever. This recognition underscores the show's lasting influence and continued popularity among audiences. In conclusion, The Twilight Zone remains a classic series known for its imaginative and mysterious storytelling, with Rod Serling's unintentional connection to the Air Force term adding an extra layer of intrigue. Its enduring appeal has earned it a place among the top cult shows in television history. As we journey through the realms of imagination, the timeless allure of the Twilight Zone beckons us to pause and reflect. It's a series that transcends time, much like the timeless dimension it so brilliantly portrayed. From the eerie chills to the mind-bending twists, the show captivated hearts and minds across generations. Perhaps you've pondered the profound moral lessons hidden within the episodes or found yourself lost in the enigmatic narrative that graced our screens in 1959. Whether you watched it in its original airings or discovered it later through streaming platforms, the impact remains indelible. The characters, the moral dilemmas, and the inexplicable occurrences continue to resonate, sparking conversations and introspection. This is your moment to share your connection with the Twilight Zone. What was your most unforgettable episode? Did Rod Serling's iconic narration send shivers down your spine? Maybe you found yourself questioning the nature of reality, just as many of the characters in the show did. Share your cherished memories, your favorite twists, or the life lessons that you've carried with you since watching this classic series. Let your thoughts and memories take flight, transcending the boundaries of time and space, just as the show did. Your unique perspective adds another layer to the rich tapestry of the Twilight Zone enthusiasts. Thank you for taking this journey with us through the shadows and dimensions of the Twilight Zone. Your time and interest are greatly appreciated. Together, we continue to unlock the mysteries of the fifth dimension.